Hi, this is James from Optimize Press, and in this video, I'm going to show you how to create high converting landing pages in Optimize Press 2.0. So, I'm here in our page building system, and the first thing I'm going to do is give my sample page a name. So, this page is going to be all about Air Mile Secrets and this is just a sample product that I'm going to create for this video. So Air Mile Secrets will be the page name. The next thing we need to do is choose a template for our page. So I'm just going to scroll down to the opt-in page templates and as you can see we've got a wide range of templates available. What I'm going to use for this template is this one here, the landing page 2 with a video. So I'm just going to scroll down to the bottom and I'm going to proceed to step two. And this is basically the process that you can follow to create any of your pages with an optimized press 2.0 and literally gives you instant access to create your pages in just a few seconds. So as you can see, I've just been loaded straight into our revolutionary live editor system, which I can use to completely customize the page to fit my requirements and the product that I'm creating. So I work, what I can do is click here on the left hand side and I can actually view the page as it would be published on the internet. So straight away I can see how it looks and I can completely customize anything on the page. So the first thing I'm going to do is add our branding. So I'm going to add a logo. So if I just click on the logo, I can choose header and navigation and I can scroll down and upload a logo. So we recommend using a transparent PNG image but any logo will work on the system. And I'm just going to upload this logo straight into WordPress now and insert it right into the page and as we can see it's going to load straight into our WordPress platform. Let's save that and see how that looks on the page. Okay so already you can see we've got the logo in there and that looks great. The next thing to do is customize some of the headlines on the page. So I can just hover over this headline here, click to edit the headline and I can add whatever text I want into here. So let's just put in travel hacking secrets revealed and you can see the page update straight away so we can see exactly how our content looks on the live page. Now with Optimize Press 2.0 you have a lot of flexibility in how you design your pages and what content you add. As you can see here we have a headline block and we also have a bullets block here and we're finding that three bullets works really well on a landing page. It's not too overloading for people and it's just enough for them to skim through, get the benefits for your product and actually go ahead and opt in which is the goal of the page. Now if you were using a video on your landing page such as this one we can just hover over this and click to edit our video and with Optimize Press you can choose from a range of different video sources to fit your requirements. Now what you can do here you can see that at the moment I'm using our built-in video player and I'm using a video hosted on Amazon S3. Now if you prefer to use a different video player such as Wistia or Easy Video Suite you can just click here and choose embed code and just paste your embed code right into the page. If you'd like to use YouTube, you can just grab a YouTube video URL, paste it straight into here and go ahead and publish, you just set your video settings and you can even put a border around your video if you want. You can set the video to autoplay, you can hide the controls and you can even force HD mode with YouTube videos and you can just click insert and the video will be inserted right into the page ready to go. Now another thing you can do with Optimize Press 2.0 is easily integrate your autoresponders so your subscribers will be added straight to your list in just a few seconds. So with this system here, if I just click to edit this opt-in box, you'll be able to see that with the integrations that I've created, I can hook straight into my autoresponders. So we have a number of options here with the integration type. If you want to just collect the leads and send them straight to your email account, you can choose the email data option. Now we recommend using an autoresponder so you can create follow-up sequences. With this page, I'm going to use Aweber. So what I'm going to do is choose my Aweber and because I've integrated Aweber into the system it's going to pull in all of my lists in Aweber so I can just choose a list where I want to send my subscribers, enter in a thank you page and we can also choose whether or not we want to show the name field on this form. Now obviously the less fields you collect on your opt-in forms the better, you're going to have a higher rate of opt-ins but obviously if you want to be able to follow up with individuals and you may want their name then you can disable this so you can show the name field it's really up to you we can also integrate with GoToWebinar and add leads straight into our GoToWebinar account so I'm going to click insert and now my Aweber system is going to be automatically integrated with this opt-in form so when people opt in they're going to get sent straight to Aweber and you can then follow up with them 
We've integrated our autoresponder with the opt-in form on the page, then the page is essentially ready to be published and actually go live so we can start collecting emails and opt-ins from your subscribers. Now that was created in under five minutes, but what I want to do now is just show you a few extra features that we have in Optimize Press for people that want to take things a little bit further and actually customize their pages even more. So one of the first things I want to show you is how you can customize the elements on the page to fit whatever you want to do. So let's say for example I wanted to use an ebook on this landing page rather than a video. All that I would need to do to do that is just click the X on this video to remove the video element and then I need to show the controls on the page and I'm going to click to add an element and this gives access to our element browser where you can choose from hundreds of different elements for your page to add functionality to your sales pages, landing pages and membership portals. So the image that the element that I want to use is an image element. So I'm just going to type in image here into the search and you can see I have this images element. The next thing to do would be to choose the style for your image so we can choose different border styles if we want. For this one because it's actually an ebook I don't want a border so I'm just going to click the standard style and then we can just select a file to upload to our site. So once we've uploaded the image we can insert that into the image element and I'm going to scroll down and insert this into the page and we can see straight away this is how our page looks with the ebook cover in it and that was just added in just a few seconds so you can see we've just converted this page from a video landing page to an ebook page and you can always clone your pages as well and test different styles of pages to see what converts best for you you can also do things like change the style of this opt-in form so if we wanted to change the button style to fit our branding we can just click to edit the opt-in form and we can choose from the submit button options we can customize the text on the button if we wish but what I'm going to do is choose to create a custom button and this gives access to our button creator where you can customize the style of your button to fit your brand so if I just click on this option here we actually get a range of pre-made styles for your button so what I'm going to do is scroll down to the get it now style of button and you can see here this is how the button looks right now what I'm going to do is I'm going to set this to be a 100% width button and I'm going to increase the height and also in the text options I'm just going to increase the font size now once that's ready I'm just going to scroll down and click insert and we'll see how this opt-in button looks on the page so you can see we've got a really high impact yellow button for the page and that's now ready to be published you can set this page to be published save and continue and the page will be published to your WordPress site ready to be used for collecting opt-ins. And that was all created in just a few minutes with the new Optimize Press 2.0 platform. If you want to start creating your opt-in pages, sales pages and membership portals in the brand new Optimize Press 2.0 platform, click the link below to find out more right now.